So, for everyone just tuning in, hello, welcome. Today we're going gonna try doing a salad run where I can only work from a single tile. As you can see, I'm boxed in by all the different things that I'll need to make a salad. And uh, yeah, hopefully we'll be able to make it all the way to the end. And by the end, I mean a franchise. Um, some goals for this are to one, we'll make it to day 15 for the franchise and two, use some of the extra space here you see in the back to automate some of the salad process. Maybe. I'm like just getting into automation, haven't really done too much of it yet. Uh, or in any of my previous runs. It would be cool. And why are we doing salads? Because I haven't franchised salads yet. At all. Uh, foods I haven't franchised yet are salads, steaks, and recently unlocked hot dogs. But, uh, so... I'm gonna do a run, I'm gonna try doing it with those. I know I've done a single, t a single tile challenge before with burgers, but that was on my second day of playing the game. I didn't really understand too much of what was going on, but now I'm on probably a week or so. So hopefully we'll, we'll see what the difference is like. And I, th I think the difference will be found in doing those automations and stuff, but we'll see. Maybe it'll just go the same. Maybe, maybe there's not really too much to do here. I doubt it. There's definitely a lot to do in every run of played up. Either way, let's just get started. Let's do it. Actually, in, in the previous one, I... Okay, hold on. Let's focus up a little bit. Also, I do have visits enabled. So if anyone wants to visit the restaurant while I'm doing all this, feel free to. Well, what I was trying to say is that um, when I did the single tile burger run, I had used that seed previously. It, Mostly because I tried sending the burger challenge many times in a row. And I started to memorize some of um, what was going on there. This time, this is my first time playing this seed in particular. So I won't know what I'll be getting at all. I might play it a little bit safer. If you watched my burger tile run, you saw me full send the booking desk on the first two days. It's because I knew I could handle it. But we are in uncharted territory here. Um, yep. Okay. I can actually put the salad in the sink like that for faster service. I don't know how much faster it needs to be. And I'm able to actually have two countertops here, which is really nice. So in, in that respect, it might be easier than the burger run, but Oh no. Do people think that salads are harder than burgers? I thought burgers were pretty easy. Mm. Okay. Can we make it through first day with no issues whatsoever? It's funny, okay, so I, I set I set up this uh the tiles the way I did so the so the blueprints would spawn like on the right. I, I they might they might still spawn on the left. I for because I've seen in like speedruns and stuff. I've watched like one speedrun, <laughs> and I, that I, I'm pretty sure that their setup also manipulates where their blueprint spawn, so that it can uh, help them upgrade stuff faster. But that's that doesn't that's not going to apply to me. So yeah, I don't know what I was thinking. My head might have been in the right space though. Uh, let's see, research desk is going to be cool somehow in the long run. I wonder if I do it now, or if I just save the research desk. Do I need... I don't need two counters right now. And getting getting a better sink... Actually, yeah, I, I, I'm gonna want to try to research for a better sink. Because that, that uh, default sink isn't gonna cut it in the long term for a single tile run. But I think I think it's early enough to where I can sacrifice a counter space for this uh, research desk. Go. Oh, I guess this is still adjacent. That's still adjacent. And uh, yeah, we'll 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 see how this goes with just one counter space. Shouldn't be too bad because I still have the sink. We'll just research a little bit. 
we'll, we'll play we'll play it a little safe we'll play it a little safe okay i want tomatoes yeah when i um when i'm doing my run or dreaming and stuff i i like just visiting my own restaurant just so people know that it's an option okay we'll call someone in get in here got a wash basin i'm not sure how much i like that compared to a power sink Let's see. Okay, they both want tomato. So the pre-drop was fine. I think as long as I don't have sides, pre-dropping should be fine. Because I'm going to have to be on top of making stuff anyway. Hold on to this for me real quick, would you? Okay. We'll call the other group in. Give me another group in. I got a solo diner here, so I'll be able to send this guy out pretty fast. I just had to wash his tomato slice before serving him. Yep. And this person probably wants tomato also. Yep. All tomatoes today. <laughs> okay. I don't think I'll do the wash basin. Oh, you know what? No. Doing a wash basin in a single tile run is not good because you can't use a wash basin as a counter space wash basins can only hold dishes uh i actually failed the single tile burger run because i didn't know that at the time but i know better know a little bit better now we're gonna we're gonna re-roll the sink still wash basin is the only one that you can't do that for so do this again expected customers eight Cool, so let's try for a power sink or something. Um, some conveyor belts would be cool too. And then we can... We can just start off with two like this. You can get research done off rip. I think it's better to do research at the end of the day. Oof, okay, here we go. This is why I didn't want to... This is why you shouldn't pre-plate stuff. Now I just gotta hope that someone orders... The salad with tomato in it. There's two people here, so hopefully one of them will do it. I can- It's safe to do this. Perfect. You're saved. I might just have to make the salads to order. Because if I run out of a counter space and I can't- And I'm not actionable anymore, or there's nowhere to drop a dirty dish, that could be a run killer. I'm gonna call a person in, because this is- Oh, this is actually a duo, but it's okay. Oops okay to do this because if they want tomato I just make the tomato and they're patient enough cool pick up drop they can sit down and then we'll hit the booking desk one more time since it looks like I can yeah. not a big deal that person can wait let's see what you guys want cool Oop, gotta drop it. We'll just finish this now. Another wash basin. Getting trolled. Well, that's to be expected. Gotta be prepared for the worst. Don't do a tomato or else you'll be stuck with it. And it would be a run killer if I accidentally cut the tomato too far too. Okay. Let's see what our first active card will be. Minus one maximum group size adds chips to the side. Um, chips require three spots because it requires, well, okay. It would require two additional spots because I need a spot for the potato and a spot for the hob, which means I would be limiting myself to only one table for this entire run. Wouldn't be good. Individual dining could be good, but um, the queue time, there might be a long line outside. But theoretically, I should be able to get the salads done or clear people out faster. I'm only serving one person at a time. So we're going to try to research a sink again. I don't need a sack of plates because I'm never going to need more than four plates. I don't even have enough counter space to manage more than four plates anyway. So, uh, yeah. 
And actually, I could even make them sit even faster by only letting them sit in that chair. I think the time to get... They, they have to walk to a chair. I think the time to walk to this chair and sit down is faster than taking than the time to walk to that chair and sit down. So, that's how we're going to do this. Hopefully we get a power sink this time. And then we can start thinking about automation. I, I don't want to spend too much money until I have to, and I forgot to make it one seat. So, that's cool. Cool. Let's call some diners in. Okay. Don't make, don't pre-make too many salads, Austin. We now have a line of two. Cool. Yeah. Individual dining, not bad. If I get a coffee table, though, that would be sweet. I feel like I can, I I have there's like a fifty percent chance. That whatever I put on their table is it's gonna be what they want. And I don't have to do anything else. I can start doing a different action other than waiting to serve them. At least for now. I, w I wonder if there's a world where I get the other salad toppings. Let's just call everyone in. I'll, I'll learn very fast how viable it is to do individual dining with with these runs here I, I, I'm basically emulating what a future round will look like by calling in this line but I'm just getting extra money for it now instead of you know nothing so I can handle a little bit of a line so far and that's without any upgrades that's good to know this um, I got another wash basin I'm getting trolled here that's three wash basins in a row. Um, at least even an auto soaker would let me use it as a counter space. Not a chopping one, but at least just a placing stuff down one. Uh, yeah. Okay. I, I can't do the auto soaker though because it's just too slow and I don't have the option of manually washing if I get it. So, nine customers, still pretty easy, but I might have to start rolling down somewhat soon-ish. We'll just call someone in right away, get an extra five gold off rip. I think it's okay to do this. Okay, yeah, this this might be okay. Yep. On another person. Okay. I don't want to do too much. I'm slowly limit testing, but without throwing. Go. It would be very sad to throw this early into the run. But stuff happened. That, that happened in my burger run. I tried to do a little bit too much with too little space. And uh, I paid the price for it significantly. Also, unlike the burger run, this is the first run I'm doing in the day. The burger run I played for a few hours before. And uh, I am at a higher mental capacity and you know what, that that might be true for all my runs actually Mo all my other runs i had played for a couple hours before with friends and whatever i had also worked prior to playing i'm playing on a day off which is crazy i even have that option have a day off let's okay, here we go now we're getting into a little bit more precarious territory that q time is going down, but not as fast as I thought. So we're good. I should pay attention to if it's um, raining outside, and that that might determine how much I hit the booking desk for a run. It's not raining outside right now though, so we're good. And then it looks like this is gonna be the last guy, so I'm just gonna get the research done before I forget, and we get another wash basin. That's I'm four for four on wash basins. If only it was something I wanted. Even upgrading a wash basin into a dishwasher wouldn't work. Because I only have four plates, and then what happens when I have to uh, serve someone super fast, you know? I forget what Charming does. I'm gonna look it up real quick. What does Charming do? Um, I know Formal decreases the mess is made at three. 
charming played up wiki will, will the three one or the level one charming help me at all will it help me unfortunately i didn't get exclusive here i think a longer queue time patience would have helped quite a bit um even oh affordable would have been nice decrease eating and thinking time i don't really need thinking time okay charming increases service patience I don't need that, but level three where customers will sit at the table before it's cleared would be nice, but that's also a lot of gold investment that I don't think I'll hit on this run. Formal decreases in mess and bonus patients, living food tables. Okay, it straight up doesn't matter which one I do here. I'm this is purely cosmetic, so we'll be a little bit charming. Maybe that might help with the viewership. Um I was gonna take a blueprint and put it in there just to um help with my reroll chances later but it doesn't even matter because i already have a blueprint that i'm not going to use in there so let's go again call someone in i'm only serving myself right now and i only want grass this time which is cool. let's wash and also just lettuce very nice um, this guy's gonna want lettuce and tomato for sure, though. Unless... Yeah, okay. How do I know that? I don't know. I, I have a I have pretty... The odds are pretty good to just get the order right. You know, it's only 50-50. This guy wants lettuce. Yep. See what I mean? I can just save one of them and then I might be right. If I'm right every time, then... Maybe I should've went to a casino and said lettuce, tomato. Yep. I even pre-dropped that one on accident. Probably shouldn't have done that. What up, Josh? Oh, look, you you get put into the queue right away. Hell yeah. Glad, glad to see that you want to do some uh, healthy eating at the single tile salad restaurant. Uh, right now, I'm trying to get a power sink, but I've got in four wash basins and that's just not good. But you know what else is not good? The fact that you only wanted lettuce. I have lettuce and tomato on the menu, man. <laughs> you're, you're, it's okay to get both. Like, I'll hook you up. They're the same price, also. But if if tomatoes aren't your thing, then okay. One salad, no veggies, please. Oh yeah, uh, something you can do too. Uh, if you look at the top left of the screen, you can see order exclamation order one and order two. Um, you can pick which one you get actually. Uh, I don't I don't know if you have to do it while you. I I don't know if you can do it before. Um, you visit, but. I think it has to be when the day starts, because it, it changes um, with each day. At least the order of it, just so you don't... can't just keep spamming order one and just get lettuce all the time. I think they swap. But I also might be making that up, because no one's really used that yet. One tight workspace? Yes, sir. That's the point. Doing a challenge run. Making the game harder for no reason. Well, for the reason of making content videos, you know. Right, there's no salad dressing? Oh, we can put it in the Discord suggestions. That said, the closest thing to salad dressing is the hot dogs with ketchup and stuff. So they, uh, maybe they just l saved it for that, because I think adding dressing would make salads a lot harder. Anyway. Morning rush, more customers at the start of each day. Or salad toppings adds olives and onions as a salad topping. Hmm. Okay. More more customers wouldn't be that bad. I'll just take out the I'll just take out the the booking desk. Yeah, because I, I don't think I'll need the booking desk anymore. I have a decent amount of money. I there was there is a world where I do a single tile salad run where I add olives and onions as a topping. Is it this world though? Is it this world? My previous card is individual dining, so I'm only going to ever get tables with one diner in them. Um, adding olives and onions takes up two more spots, which would limit me to one table, which might be okay early game, since I'm only serving one person at a time. But even now, they're starting to become a longer line and I can only serve people so fast. So I think I'm gonna go... 
Yeah, okay, so the maybe if I had more automation or something. No, even then. Even then, I don't think I'd do salad toppings. I'll, I'll, I'll theorycraft it for when I'm a better player at this game. But for now, I'm going to do more customers at the start of each day. Because now, with individual dining, this is something that I can take advantage of for this run. In particular, I can actually have three dining tables that people sit at. Um, ooh, another blueprint cabinet. Okay, we buy the blueprint cabinet for sure. Can go here. Dishwasher can go in there. Um, I won't use the booking desk anymore. I I have money. We will buy another dining table. We'll do it like this. No, we'll do. It. Damn. Okay, I could. I can still only have two. If I put them together, then it's just going to count as one table. Never mind. I'm tripping. Okay, uh, two, this is the max amount of tables I can have. Which means I can still research, which is cool. Mm -hmm. Put that in there for now. I do want to research the sink. We'll do it like this. I gotta somehow get back in here. Oh, okay, well, I have to move this so people can actually sit at this table. How did I do it again? Like this. Like this, this, this. 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 Oh, I gotta put... Okay, this. This, this, this. Oh man, the space management for a single tile is kind of nuts. And we go back into our little corner here. Okay. Gotta get rid of this. There we go. Now we have two tables. We can serve more than one person. Taking advantage of the fact that I have single diners. I'm expecting 14 customers today, so let's let's run let's run this. Let's see how this goes. Oh, okay. Serving myself first. No booking desks, so no rush. Uh, soaking sink. I mean, at least it's not a wash basin this time. I kind of wish it was now, though, because it would be pretty funny if I got five wash basins in a row. Still looking for the power sink, though. The soaking sink, unfortunately, has no room in this kitchen. There's not that much room at all. Also, thank you for your patronage, J996. Um, yeah, okay. Two tables with individual dining. Not bad. See, look, now I can serve this guy. He wants tomatoes this time, but it's okay. Um, I wonder if I'll be able to keep up this talking pace in the later days. Oops, this is what you want, but it's okay. At least now, I was able to seat that guy earlier. Let's get both of them set up. What What do you want? You want tomatoes. That's cool. And you just want lettuce. See, that works out kind of nicely. Okay, and then we'll have you sit at the closer desk. That was a morning rush also. So that... That was an increased amount of customers than I should be expecting at that time. But I'm sure that number will increase as I get farther into the into the round. Or into into this run rather. I'm only on day seven of fifteen. Oh, this guy wants tomatoes. Gotta pay a little bit more attention, Austin. It's okay. Honestly, this might be a little run. <laughs> I mean not not a little run, but this might be a little easy. We'll see. I don't even have the power sink. Let's imagine if they, they didn't give me a power sink because it might be too easy with one. I'd be able to bust way too fast. Okay. Doo -doo. Yeah. Okay. Individual dining. Very good for this. Don't have to think very hard and I moved my mic on accident. Let's let's readjust it. And then we serve this person. Oh, thought the day was over. It's not. It's still young. There we go. And we might get one more person. At least. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Why, why am I saying at least as if there's going to be a group larger than one? I guess it's just a... Uh, 
but what I'm expected to experience since I don't get individual dining very often. I think I got individual dining once before, and that was it. 88 gold this round, not bad. Now we gotta get out of here somehow. <laughs> yeah, let's uh, let's see what we got. Another dining table, counter plates, simple tablecloth. No, this is like just not good for individual dining. Um, okay, well we have two. I I think we roll here. I didn't even get a sink this time. And now I can do this, and I have 400 gold. The reason why I have those two blueprint cabinets is so, even if I'm not going to use the blueprints I saved in there, it's for this purpose right here. Now when I reroll blueprints, I'm going to have two more blueprints to roll from that I didn't have previously. So let's see what we can roll for. Prep station. Hmm. I don't think a prep station has anywhere to go in my setup this time around. Until until I get can get rid of my research station, the prep station unfortunately will not go where I or I, I can't do that. I I I still need a uh, a power wash, or I would still like to have a power wash station. But for now, a coffee table is fantastic. I will take a workstation just because I can I can get rid of this counter now, and by get rid of it, I mean just put it up there. Workstation will help me chop stuff faster, like why would I not do this? And the question is, do I roll again now? Or do I be satisfied with the upgrades that I have? And the question, is, or the answer, that I'll just be satisfied with uh, what I got so far. And then we'll, we'll go for a better reroll next time. I actually don't even need a... Uh... I don't need the research station this time, or this round, in particular. I'm not researching anything, so we'll just grab an extra counter, just for, um, oh well, hold on. I can't do that. We're gonna push this in just a little bit. Make some room for them to sit at that table. Let me put this back over here, and we take this there and we rotate everything so it's oriented the correct way and now we can start this should be even easier now because i have the coffee table and yeah oops Oop. make sure everything's facing the right way there we go and let's go okay increased productivity don't want to do too many there we go there's some grass for you, brother. And, uh, yeah, let's go. There's me. I wonder if I'll even have to use the coffee table today. I mean, I'm sure I will. But this is the morning rush. This is supposed to be when more people... Okay, now we hit the morning rush. Let's see. Let's see what kind of volume we get here. Okay, yeah. Immediately, immediately using the coffee table. That's cool, though. That's what it's there for. Oh, coffee table is good because the queue at the coffee table is a lot longer than the queue outside. Oop. I don't know how I managed to do that. Okay, don't, don't choke, don't choke. Not choking, I'm thriving. Make sure I don't turn or make tomato paste, that would be bad. But also not unsalvageable with my extra counter space right now. I don't know if I thought this challenge would be easier or harder than it is right now. I was kind of hoping for some automation stuff, but it doesn't look like it's going to happen this time. Just because we're already pretty late into the game. Unless I keep going into overtime. I'm considering it, actually. I don't really have a plan for after this, so... Maybe we, maybe we will go into overtime. But that's also thinking pretty far ahead. I just got to make it day 15 first before I even start thinking about that. And also a power wash sink. <laughs> power wash sink would be nice. Having this extra counter is crazy. I, 
I almost feel like I should have put the booking desk back. Like if I can't research something, then I should get extra money, right? Especially if, if the long-term goal is automation, I'm gonna want money to be able to afford any automation that I want. Right now, 400 gold is not a lot. Especially for like how much, how expensive all the automation stuff is. 400 gold is a lot if you want to keep it simple, but hmm. In hindsight, I should have picked... I, I don't remember what the options are. I think I had for, formal and charming. Uh, maybe I should have picked formal... I, oh, well, whatever. That, that's also a lot of extra money too, so may, maybe it doesn't matter. I'm just kind of rambling to myself right now. Hope you guys don't mind that. Um, we will bring the research station back now because I would like the power sink. Um, we'll actually drop the portioner and keep the prep station just in case. Well, no, because having the extra counter space is probably going to be more valuable than having uh -oh. having a prep station. I don't think a prep station fits, unfortunately. Unless, or until I get automation. Once I, if I, if I'm able to automate any part of this process, like lettuce, and then have that be put into a prep station, then that's where I'll find value. But it's not going to be this time. How did I do it last time? I, I gotta move, I gotta make room. I gotta do this. Can't put it there. And go down here. And go there. Oh, I went too far. This is supposed to go right there. And this goes right here. This has to go somewhere else. And <laughs> kind of funny. There. Then, oh. Okay. Then I gotta go back out to put the sink in there. Then now, oop. Last time I didn't put the. Oh no, I, I can I can fix it from here. I was gonna say last time I didn't fix the chair, but I did. I did. I just event realized it at the last second. And uh, yeah, I think we're ready to go now. If we get a power sink, that would be huge. Cause then I don't have to research anything for a long while. Maybe I can research for another workstation on this side, but it, it hasn't been a big deal. I'm serving 19 people today, and I've talked a lot, so I'm gonna <laughs> drink some water. Stay hydrated. Oh, stay hydrated out there, chefs. Let's go. I'm just gonna research off rip. Not like I have uh, anything better to do right now. Another soaking sink. Thank you, Josh, for only ordering that. <laughs> I wonder if it's because you typed in order two earlier, if it's only going to give you order two. I don't know. Because order two this time was just lettuce. But you also typed that in a while ago. It wasn't this day. Oh, man. Oh, this is the morning rush here. Okay, that's a decent rush. Gotta focus up just a bit. But it's okay. People ordering just lettuce makes things really nice. Like that. Pick up and drop dirty plates to get people seated faster. Okay. Oh, wait. Don't throw this. I gotta wash the dish now because I'm running out of counter space. Perfect. That gives me time to wash dishes. Also gives me more time to wash dishes. Okay, this has gotta go. You want tomato, it's okay though. I gotta wash this one. Okay, this is this is where I actually have to start trying a little bit. Seems so if my um, if my commentary starts getting a little repetitive, then my bad. 
I'm focusing up here. We are so close to getting another video. <laughs> it would it would be a shame to throw now this far into the game as I'm looking at the time instead of the orders. Damn son. Oh I'm throwing. I'm not throwing that hard. I think this workstation is saving my life. Okay. I do need a power wash sink though, damn. Perfect. That that might have saved the run. But damn, this power not having a power wash sink is going to kill me. Oh. Also not paying attention to a few times. I didn't realize there was still another person outside. And we barely make it. We will take that. And I'm not even gonna clean. Because I don't have to anymore. Day 9. Okay, day 9 is the first um, sense of struggle. I think we're going into a cosmetic round too. Can't add chips. We already, we've been over this. Please don't be a cosmetic crown. Okay. Oh, we, we, we got... Cool. I think I ha I roll down here, though. I think I have to roll down here. As much as I want to save a sink, I might be able to just roll for... Uh, roll for a so uh, power sink instead. So what am I looking for? I'm looking for a power sink. Yeah, I'm looking for a power sink. Oh, another blueprint cabinet. That's good. So long as we can uh, make use of it. Go. I'm eventually going to have to move those. But I don't have to right now. Ray stand, flower, sharp. No, nothing. Fair. I'd love to save this. But I need to save the run first. Oh, I need to save the run first. Another blue green cabinet? Jesus. Okay, well. This is gonna help in the long run. Oh, I, I'm running out of valuable rolls here. Okay, okay, okay. Hold on. That, that's all I'm going to roll for now, because my next rolls are going to be crazy. I'm not going to research anything. I think having an extra... I'm, I'm banking on having an extra counter space will help a lot. Um, with queue times. It's not like it was impossible. It wasn't an impossible run this time. Damn, son. Okay. 20 customers. I think that's only one more than yesterday. We have five blueprint cabinets now. I might have been able to just save one instead of uh, buying it this round. Since I only have four blueprints and five blueprint cabinets, but... You know, I've never had this many blueprint cabinets before, so I'm kind of excited. We put everything away, because the next rerolls are gonna... I, I, I rerolls are expensive now, so I'm gonna need to... I'm gonna need as many blueprints as possible for the future ones, right? I wonder if I should have stopped earlier with the rolling. But that's something for me to regret later, not something for me to regret now. I mean, the run's not even dead yet. The run is still alive. Do it like this. You know, I could even put the coffee table closer. But I want the coffee table closer is the question though. Then that makes their dining um or their their waiting time lower. Or faster. Something. I don't think we have to think about it that hard. Just have to make sure that we stay on point here. Alright, this is a 
big round. Uh, next two rounds are big rounds actually, because next round's a cosmetic round, so I have to be able to beat this round and the next one without any upgrades. I'm hoping for the best here. Let's go. A little co careful here. The fact that I can't see the progress bar is uh, a little unnerving. I don't want to make uh, what's it called? Tomato paste. That would kill my run. And the workstation makes it so fast, too. Okay, I, ba I basically just gotta... Okay, I think, I think I have the timing down now. For the tomato cuts. Muscle memory type vibe. I don't have the memory for lettuce, but... Because I don't need it. Yeah. Even though I can just uh, lift up the dirty plate and drop it on the table, having this extra counter lets me serve people without having to clear the, the plate. Um, if that makes sense. I, I know it probably doesn't make... I could be a bit more concise with what I'm saying, but, um, you know, I'm in a high-pressure environment right now. Got a lot on the line here. And, uh, yeah, hopefully, if you've been following along with the video, that you're able to understand where I'm coming from with what I'm saying. I don't know. Hopefully. Look, I can have two dirty dishes and still serve people now, as opposed to just one. That's what I'm trying to say, I think. And now all my plates are dirty, so I'm gonna have to wash some of them. Making the absolute most out of these four plates here. I don't want to get too many plates because that's gonna. Then I'm gonna risk overplating, which wouldn't be good. Hey, you want just lettuce? That's good. We'll get you out of the way first. Okay, gotta wash some stuff. You both want tomatoes, okay. You both get tomatoes then. And, okay, we're actually, we're actually okay. As long as I pay, when I'm paying attention, we are golden. Perfect, and you only want lettuce, and that's all four plates in use. Let's go. Four ten. And I think I picked. No, I picked charming, so I don't need that, unfortunately. So we go again. Oh, four thirty-five. Okay. Oh, you know what? Here, here's here is what I will do though. I will save one of the blueprints, regardless of what it is. It'll help me with my re-rolling next round. Yep. Now I have one more blueprint to reroll, so not a completely uh, passed up round. Because it, it won't it won't reroll into a cosmetic thing next round. At least that's how I think it'll work. Now I have one more customer than yesterday. Start with some lettuce. Get two going. I think I could even get a third one going. Yeah. But that's all I'll do. I can stay on top of having a three rotation like this. I mean, I'm not going to be able to because of the volume, but okay. Even this is a little risky. They won't. S oh, they will sit there. What? 
I don't understand how that works entirely, because sometimes they won't sit when there's, like, prepared food like that. And here's the morning rush. I'm gonna shut up just a little bit. Perhaps. It looks like we're gonna make it through the morning rush just fine. Okay, gotta wash some plates now. All my plates are dirty. Doesn't mean I have to do all four at once. I can just leave dirty plates in front of customers for some reason. Maybe I'll make a clean, uh, challenge where I have to maintain like actual restaurant cleanliness or something. Eventually, but not right now. Man, everyone wants tomatoes today. Yeah. We are good on time. The person outside is waiting a little bit, but it's okay. Can I put- okay, I can put another plate down when they're eating. That's good to know, that's for science. You know what else is for science? Um, a diet of just lettuce. I'm sure dietitians agree with that stuff. This, however, is not a dietitian because he wants tomatoes on his. I don't know. Shout out to the dietitians that watch this video and to all friends of dietitians that are tuned in. Is it too early to say uh, like and subscribe to the video um, and to follow the channel? And all of that, if you like the content, I want to support a small content creator or whatever. I haven't even finished the run yet, but we're doing the self-plug right now on day 11. And I almost made tomato paste as a result of that uh, early self-plug. It's been kind of funny too, to throw during a self-plug. Everyone wants tomatoes. Except probably the guy that I didn't take the order from, yep. And everyone's in the restaurant. We're gonna... We're gonna get away with this one. How long can he keep getting away with it though, is the question. Probably a while. There we go. And we make it through day 11. Now this... This is gonna be the fun part, I think. This is gonna be... Is this going to be the sick reroll that we're hoping for? Or am I just going to get what I want? There's no mess for me, so it's okay. Alright, sick reroll time. What will we get? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to at least reroll once. Because there isn't even a sink here. Question is... Do I still try to research for a power sink? Do I even have enough tiles to do this all in one row? Let's, I think I do. I think I have just, just enough, actually. Alright, sick reroll time. How many blueprints is this even? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. We're gonna reroll 10 blueprints at once. That is nuts. I wonder what the stats are for what happens when you reroll 10 blueprints. This is- the rerolls are getting expensive now. 70 reroll. Just double check that I don't want any of this. Yeah, I don't need or want any of this. So we reroll. We oh, more conveyors. Scrubbing brush. Play stand. Spray stand. Nope. We go one more time. Another blueprint cap. God. Okay. I'm down. And then- Oh my. Okay, and then now we save. We save the money for an even sicker reroll. Because we're pretty chillin', I think. We are pretty chillin' right now. Um. Can't believe I can't get a power sink, though. I don't even think I can afford to use a research station now. Because of, um. I don't know. 
of how many people I'm getting. The longer I take to research this power sink, the less viable this run becomes. But maybe I'll just get something sick, like super sick nasty. It'll just uh, change my life for the better here. I probably could have bought some automation stuff now at this point. I probably could have done that actually. Uh, you know what? A little too late now. This is going to be something that where I watch back and be like, damn Austin, why did you do it that way? But that that's just uh, inherent of VOD review, I think. No matter what, you, you'll you watch back and then you'll be like, okay, those are, those are a bunch of mistakes that you made. You could have played this way better. But that's something you take into your next run, your future run. Not going to be a master of this game after only a week, you know? So. Focus up. Welcome back, Josh. You actually beat me to the restaurant this time. Oh, shoot. Okay. They made all of my plates already. Hello, me. Of course, I want tomatoes. Oh, maybe we'll, they will just sit if there's food there. to get people sitting at the table as soon as possible just so their um, order time reduced to now I actually just have to wash a dish Oops, just a bit okay all my plates are out okay and it's raining this is not good but it's not over I gotta save this friend. This would be so much easier with the power sink. Alas. Lettuce. Oh. oh, shit. No, we were so close. I really needed a power sink. I needed a power sink so bad. But, um... I don't know. It was still a cool run. Well, um... I think we'll try it again. <laughs>